hey guys welcome back so in this skin clarifying serum recipe i'm first going to be dissolving my azelaic acid powder recall that one of the best solvents to dissolve this powder is our propylene glycol so i'm going to be mixing both azelaic acid powder and my propylene glycol in a beaker and then i'll take this to a double boiler Azelaic acid actually works by reducing skin sebum, thereby reducing the presence of acne. It helps to prevent and also treat acne. Also, azelaic acid can help to brighten the skin, clarify it, and give it an even look. Some say that this powder has anti-aging properties and, and that is very much um, underrated when it comes to brightening. So after dissolving, I'm just going to set this aside and in another beaker, I'm going to be dissolving my tranexamic acid powder. So here I have distilled water in my beaker and tranexamic acid powder in my watch glass. Tranexamic acid will actually dissolve sparingly in cold water. Now, tranexamic acid is another very potent brightening powder. It helps to clear hyperpigmentation, discolorations, melasma and even helps to reduce acne scars. It helps to generally improve skin tone and skin tone. Texture. See that our tranexamic acid powder is already dissolved. I'll set this aside and next I'm going to be dissolving my allantoin powder. Allantoin acts as a moisturizer that helps to prevent dry, scaly, and rough skin. It also helps to soothe irritations that may come up from any ingredients in the product. I am dissolving allantoin powder here in a portion of distilled water that I set aside from the measured out distilled water in the formula. Allantoin may quickly dissolve in warm water so if your water is not warm you can as well just take it to the double boiler for a few minutes and allow the water to become clear in another beaker I'm going to be measuring out my oil fees firstly I have my kojic acid dipalmitate powder which is an oil soluble powder kojic acid dipalmitate is a very stable form of kojic acid and it's also a very potent skin brightener many people will use it in skin lightening products and they do just fine with it kojic acid also helps to feed acne scars and it also helps to brighten the skin potently in fact kojic acid will help you to achieve a yellow skin tone then i'm going to be using olivine 1000 emulsifier here just to help this emulsify since it's going to contain a very little bit of oils and then it's going to be mixed with water so yeah i'm using olivine 1000 and you can substitute this with e-wax i will then add my lemon infused oil into this mix everything together and take this to a double boiler to fully dissolve while i wait for this to fully dissolve here is my azelaic acid powder in propylene glycol fully dissolved in the double boiler Alatoin powder also fully dissolved in distilled water after being in a double boiler for very few minutes. And our oil fees, including kojic acid dipalmitate, olivine 1000, and lemon infused oil, fully dissolved as well. So here is the oil fee azelaic acid dissolved in propylene glycol, tranexamic acid dissolved in distilled water and allantoin powder dissolved in distilled water so after dissolving all my ingredients it's time to mix them together so i'm going to be adding the oil phase and one of the water phases together first and then i'm just going to blend You can add any of the dissolved ingredients first with the oil fizz, but make sure to add the hot one first. Then I added my allantoin and kept missing and then I'm going to add the last fizz which is my azelaic acid in propylene glycol.
but before i continue i'll need this formulation to have a serum like texture and also need it to be more hydrating so i'm going to be adding a little xanthan gum and i'll be dissolving it with a little of the propylene glyco and azelaic acid solution that is already made and then i'm just going to mix this and allow it to hydrate until it fully dissolves on the other hand, I will be mixing my hyaluronic acid in vegetable glycerin. This hyaluronic acid will help the product not to be drying at all on the skin. It will help to give this hydrating feel and also help to act as an anti-aging ingredient. I'm adding isopropyl meristate into this, mixing it together and taking it into the formulation. I'll then bring back my xanthan gum mixture in azelaic acid. See that I almost used all the azelaic acid um, solution to dissolve this and this is the remaining one. That's because I was supposed to have dissolved this um, xanthan gum in my vegetable glycerin alongside my hyaluronic acid. Although it will dissolve in water or propylene glycol but it will take a longer time. So I'm just going to give this a very fine mist and as you can see the serum is really thick. It's not a lotion kind of and it's not a serum kind of but it's a very beautiful hydrating product for all skin types. I'll go ahead to add my tocopherol oil which is my vitamin e oil to act as an antioxidant and to uh, improve the shape life of this product. I'm giving it a good mix and then I'm going to be adding a little bit of my lemon essential oil. This will help give a little um, lemon inspired fragrance just like we've used lemon infused oil initially. I'll go ahead to check my pH and make sure that my pH is within a very good range for my active ingredients to work with. Matching my strip against my pH paper, I got 6 and it's totally fine. I'm adding Gemma Plus preservative here to add as a preservative to inhibit the growth of microorganisms for this product and then i'm giving a fine stir and that's basically all for my beautiful clarifying azelaic acid serum you can choose to use a serum bottle like this or you can also choose to use a pump lotion bottle like this whichever one will suit well this serum can be used both day and night also can be used by on skin types and all skin complexion the serum will help to really fade scars and reduce the event of acne and its scars within a period of four to six weeks with consistent use note that this um, serum might not work alone it may also need the assistance of a good acne remover soap or a good moisturizer after this serum another good assistance to this serum is your sunscreen if you're not using your sunscreen please do not blame this serum if you find no visible effect while using it shelf life of this product is from 18 months to 24 months the serum may also change color after the first day but it does not affect the efficacy of the product if you have any more questions you can leave them in the comment section do not forget that we have all your raw cosmetic material that is suitable for this formulation right in stock and you can see the description box for more details please also consider to give this video a thumb up and also to subscribe to this channel as it encourages me to do better see that this serum leaves a glow on the skin just immediately if you're going to give this a try please let me know in the comment section down below thank you so much for watching please remain subscribed i would love to see you in my next video for now take care and have a lovely day bye